Hey hello everyone, welcome to another studying video. So today I'm going to be sh I'll be showing you my organization system for the following school year. So first I'm going to show you my binder setup because I think it was I thought it was important to um, well to show you this. Today has been a really hard day to record, so I'm sorry, <laughs> but yeah, basically I'll be using credit paper, blank paper, and lined paper, and paper with music sheets. Um, well, this is my organization system and the supplies that I mostly use. You should not use it in any way as a guide or something. Well, I use more the lined um, paper sheets because most of my um, subjects are theoretical and even the ones that are about music we need to write stuff that is not exactly music like what we write on the um, music sheets so yeah um, the music sheets I had to put them into like this folder because um, they weren't hold puncher and I couldn't punch them, hold them, whatever. Now I'm just putting here my music pieces for my singing classes because even though I don't have singing classes every day, it's something that I like to carry with me always because when I have free time I like to study and take the time to study. So basically, yeah, I'm not just showing you everything that's inside there and as you can see, you have, I'm sorry if you're hearing any noise, but yeah, I have lots more of lined paper than blank paper or rather paper. Um, basically, I have the blank paper and the graded paper because... I never know when I will make some like graphics or any scheme that I prefer to do on blank or graded paper, so yeah, it's always good to be previned. Um, yeah, I have lots of pieces this module. <laughs> I will now be showing you how I will organize everything. So basically, first of all, you already know these little folders. If you don't know them, go check out my school um, whole, yeah, whole supplies, <laughs> my school supplies all, I'm sorry, I can't talk, yeah, but I have those folders, my portfolio, and the blue binder, so basically what I will be doing is that every day when I have these subjects that belong to the folders, I take the um, paper sheets out of the binder, write them, and put in each folder. Then the portfolio will be using it for orchestra and ensemble because we get, well, we only do music, only <laughs> we do music in those subjects, so yeah. And finally, the bigger binder, it's for the papers that I won't need any longer, like in the end of the semesters or the modules in my case. And yeah, that's how it will organize me. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Hope you liked it.